A new fitness trend is sweeping the world. Plogging. It's essentially the new jogging. Here's News 5's Jessica Taloni to explain. Well, the phrase plogging comes from the Swedish word plocka, which means pick up. And that's exactly what participants are doing. It's a down and dirty workout that's far from relaxing. Yes, it's over here. Watch out for cars. Michelle Parks and her team maneuver past tourists in storefronts in central London, only slowing down when something like this gets in the way. Plogging is a Swedish craze, and it basically means to run and pick up rubbish at the same time. The group strides through the city, collecting as they go. Here's a uh, lighter. Hello. Minutes into the run, trash bags are filling up with food containers, cigarettes, and the unexpected. Uh, a child's shoe. You picked that up along the run. Yeah, along the run. The trend is gaining momentum. In less than three years, plogging has hit every continent, getting picked up in cities like Seoul and New York. I don't think it's weird anymore. I think it's something that people want to get involved in. While lugging around trash bags can make for a tough sell, oh. the workout is hard to beat. Ploggers claim they burn about 100 more calories each hour than they would on a regular jog. Yeah, it's that double endorphin hit. You come away with having known you've got fitter, but you've also done something amazing for your local communities as well. Park says speed isn't the key to having a successful plog. It's what you walk away with. The plogging craze is continuing to spread in the U.S. as well. Next month, San Antonio will become the latest city to join the plogging craze. We're still waiting for it to catch on in Mobile and Pensacola. I'm Jessica Taloni, WKRG News 5.